Hey guys, what's cooking? Happy Thursday. Thursday, right? <laughs> Is anybody off this week because of the holiday weekend? I um, had a busy day with appointments. So we have um, pulled chicken going in the crock pot and I'm gonna make a quick potato salad. And I got a lot of questions about my eggs the other day. So I thought I'd show you because I'm using the steamer. I'm gonna do potato salad eggs for that, but you could do it for egg salad. And I thought I'd just show you guys. So if you guys are hopping on live with me, say, hey, tell me what you're having for dinner. But otherwise, I'm just gonna give this a second. We're gonna see who will pop on here with us and then I will show you what I have been doing. It won't take very long as most things with Epicure don't, but I am using my round steamer. You could do your multi-purpose steamer, no problem. But I had a bag of those baby potatoes, yellow and red. Just cube those up and pop it into the microwave with the lid on. No water, no standing over the pot of boiling water. Just popped it in the microwave. My microwave, it took six minutes and these are all done. I've just had it sitting now with the lid off because I want my potatoes to cool a bit or I could pop it into the fridge. And then I like to have eggs in my potato salad. So you could do it however you like. Um, but this is also a great way that you can do egg salad um, because you don't have to um, boil and then peel all the eggs. So I did this the other day for a lunch and it was so great, I couldn't believe it. So that's how I'm gonna do for my potato salad. So I've just got my small rectangular steamer because I just want a couple of eggs. You could definitely, um, if you wanna do more eggs, do your bigger steamer and break as many eggs in there as you want. Uh, I'm just gonna pop the lid on that. I'm breaking the yolks because these are gonna be broken eggs anyways, and mine were popping the other day. So I'll be completely transparent, it was freaking me out. So we're gonna cook these up. We're gonna see what that looks like in a minute and a half. And then I'm gonna do so many different recipes on the website, you guys, whether you're doing potato salad, pasta salad, so many different ways to season it. This is one that we've been loving this summer um, for burgers, pasta salad, veggie dip, but I'm gonna do it tonight um, as potato salad because a friend of mine said she did it and thought it was fantastic. She, of course, did not measure anything. So here I am, I'm gonna wing it too, but I'm gonna, um, use a brand new thing of mayonnaise. Use whatever you want though. Mayonnaise, some Greek yogurt, a combination of those. And she said she's a little Dijon. So I'm gonna throw a little Dijon in there. Who else loves, I love summer and summer salads. Do you? Pasta salad, potato salad, um, bean salad. All those salads we cooked up um, over the weekend for our camping. And I, oops, I used too much there. I'm just gonna use about a tablespoon of this. So this is the West Coast burger seasoning. Again, if you know me, you know I'm not gonna be making a salmon burger. Um, but in here it has onion, um, herbs, garlic, sea salt, lemon powder, um, black pepper, chili, chilies. So you could use this in a bunch of different things. I'm gonna use it to make this dressing for my potato salad. So again, if you have a steamer and you're not using it, you've got to reach out to me. I want you to use it. Um, I was that way in the beginning. And then once I started using it, now I like to find all the excuses I can to use it. I don't wanna be standing boiling potatoes, so I love it for potato salad. I love it. I did it last week for pasta salad, like I said. If you're gonna do pasta salad, remember, you can do it in that multi-purpose steamer, but no lid. You'll just use the, the container and then put your, um, your tray on it. So let's see how those eggs did. So again, the potatoes were already steamed. I should show you guys. I was checking to see if they were cooked. 
but oh, my lighting is gonna be terrible. So they did pop again, but they're totally cooked. So it's like having hard boiled eggs without having to peel it. It is the craziest thing. And again, I didn't have to, because it's silicone, I didn't have to spray this or anything, but those eggs are gonna pop right out of there. But I'm gonna let them cool down for a minute. But, so here's a trick. This is what I did the other day for lunch. So I literally had the eggs just like that. I dropped in a little bit of better than bacon. So for those days that you don't have time to cook up bacon in your steamer, I did uh, bacon in my eggs and I put in some mayo and some yellow mustard and I had egg salad super fast. So I just put the bacon in my eggs here. I thought I needed more, so I also put some in the potatoes. I've got my dressing. I think all I need to do is I'm gonna let this all cool down. I'm gonna fold it over, incorporate it in, and it's all going to be done. And just that fast, we will have a pasta salad. <laughs> a potato salad, a potato salad using your steamers. So isn't that so fast, so easy? Who can't do that? I'm gonna just make sure this is, I wanna make sure my eggs are totally cooked. Yep. So again, in my microwave, those eggs just took a minute and a half. If I was doing the bigger steamer, more eggs, it might be a little bit more time. If your microwave is not NASA hot, it might be a little bit more time. Hey, Stephanie. So I don't know if you guys love summer salads, but I'm just showing you guys a really fast potato salad because I just steamed my potatoes and then I cooked up some eggs in my smaller steamer because I just wanted three eggs. Just breaking that up a little bit. Fold that all in there. So yummy, making a potato salad doesn't have to take a ton of time. Um, and it certainly can just be in charge of how much spice, how much seasoning, and also controlling the sodium that's in there or not in there. Oh, this looks great. I love to use those two kinds of potatoes, but use whatever you want. Somebody the other day was saying she um, cooks radishes and does it with radishes. So it's a low carb potato salad. I never ever knew that was a thing. So there you go. Always learning. So there you go, you guys, just that fast. I have a potato salad. It's actually a little bit warm. I just have to shred up the chicken that's been cooking in the crock pot all day with our pulled chicken. Potato salad is done and I, I don't know, I might just call it that for the night and call it dinner. But I hope you guys are having an amazing week. If you need other ideas, how to use your steamer, other recipes, please reach out to me. I want you using your steamers. I want you enjoying um, your cook time. And I hope that you are taking Epicure as you are getting out, meeting up with friends and family and just enjoying good food and good people again. So have a great night. Talk to you soon.